What's up guys, Mark here from VIP Shop Management. Today I want to talk about three important things that an update that can help you a lot. One of them is under canned jobs. If you look at canned jobs now, it have a, a, another section basically for the bottom section, customer request, diagnosis, recommendation. You can have uh, you can have it combined with parts and labor or you can have it just just one of these basically, which is really important. So if you have a note, you want to type it, you just search it and it goes directly there. Um, uh, and plus the other thing is we have, like if you go to, you, you don't have to come in here anymore and click two clicks. You can just go to can job directly from here and search, let's say test uh, 500. See, it, it, there's no parts and labor in it, but it did have a diagnosis in it and, and it puts it there automatically, which is cool. Um, if you have, let me see if I have, if I have a battery, battery, this is the test again. So it added this and that. And if you have text prior to it, it will, it will add it like as a second line. So don't worry, it's not going to delete your, whatever you typed. Keep in mind, like when you have a lot of writing right here, i um, just click on that and it's all like huge. You can sit and type whatever you need. Um, you can even use the voice if you want, or you can even clear it and, and done. So, which is cool. So keep in mind, keep like, remember that you can do that right here. It makes it a lot easier. Just when you have, when you typing a lot of stuff, I think you need this to be like in a bigger view. Um, if you have a recommendation from last time, it will add it right here. That's kind of another thing. Like if, if you have a lot of time writing in the recommendation, if you click on it, it will show you the last recommendation. Um, uh, I want to talk about another thing right here, which is really important uh, for the phone book. If you have any duplicates, because we, we transferred the other one to, to like we made contact and vendors in one, all in one. If you have any, any duplicates contact, just click on merge duplicate contact and it will automatically fix it. Um, the last thing I want to talk about, which is super important is, um, new job right here so we we change this now it tells you where where if i'm typing let's say uh, break pads it tells you it's going to a new job too right so it's going to go to a new job too and look if i switch to labor it's still telling me okay i'm still going i'm still typing in new in in job two right now break pads uh, let's say f replace uh, front and add but okay which is cool i love it the automation of it what about if i want to override it yes you can override it so let's give an example if i want to go to part again it's going to go to new job three but i don't want it to go to new job three just click on it and say i want it to be well you can select any job you want but i want it to be in job two so i can come in here and say break rotors i mean if you it doesn't really like it's not a mandatory thing. It's usually pretty smart to tell you where it's supposed to go, but if needed, it's right here. And now if I add labor, well, automatically, because it's smart enough to know it should be uh, job two still. So break rotors, replace, and then add. So you have the, the whole idea is you do have a control right now of, of going to job three and, and getting some stuff from here. Or, or, you know, or no, dismiss it. I don't want it. You know, just dismiss it. So, those three things. Let me see. Uh, where am I? Those three things are very important. Um, I do want to talk about raising the price. Yes, we did raise the price $10. You got to understand one thing. For the past three years, we haven't raised the price one penny. Everyone else raised the price like crazy. We're still the cheapest out there. Our job is to continue to be the cheapest, but the company has to be profitable. Even though we make a little bit profit, we have other companies that have to make money. So we had we only raise the price when or prices when we have to. And our goal not to raise the price. Three years we didn't raise the price one penny. It's uh and we even when we did, we only raised it ten dollars. Um look around you man. Go check Shop Monkey Tech Metric. Five hundred, it's gonna be six hundred, seven hundred. It's nonstop. They just don't care. It's crazy. And are they better than this one? Of course not. Let's just be honest here. It's all BS. Anyway, appreciate you guys. Thanks for watching.